Hey guys, my name is Samsonite, and welcome to, what the hell is this game even called? Forest Dungeon. Uh, settings, yeah, okay, cool. Escape, oh, that's cool, I've, I've, I always kind of like that. Press escape or P to pause, okay. Kick. Kick. Spooky. Sprint. Uh, I guess the only goal is to escape. No. Someone's breathing in there. That's blood. Clearly. Wait, I didn't check this door. Okay. So I can't open any of those doors. I want this. Can I take this with me? Fire, yes, I want it. Give it, I want this. Damn. You're really not gonna let me take nothing, are you? This kinda gives me Dungeon Nightmares vibes. Which I never beat. That game is genuinely scary to me. It's a good, no. Why'd you go away? See, sometimes if you just see something and then you go for it, we just run away. I can use it downstairs. Ah, I want to take the fire and beat your face with it. Everything's fine. There's a no. The music stops, so I'm supposed to be scared. Got to find the storage room. This is the no room. That's the storage room. I would like to take this torch, please. Okay. Note. Out of matches, grab a torch from the table and light it with a torch in the hallway or wherever. Torch. Jail keys. I should be able to open all jail doors now. Great. I see you looking at me. Alright, so the bull-shaped skull that used to be in the storage is, um, it's gone. Should not have messed with that bull. Well, mess with the bull, you get the horns, right? We're going to open no last, I think. Okay. Still? That's... Hmm. If I was a mom... This would be kind of shocking. Alright, let's see. Over here there were aboos, but I couldn't see. Now I can see. Oh, the music doesn't stop. <laughs> oh, ah! Dimitri texted me. Damn it. As that happened, Dimitri texted me about D&D &D stuff. Outside door. Oh. There's a skeleton. Ha ha! Oh. Okay, that was a little cuter than most jump scares. That was something. That bull skull scared the shit out of me. And it was kind of cartoony. Like, it, I mean, but with a game with these kind of graphics, that's how it's going to be. Spare key for outside door. Lock the outside door behind you like always. Can't say it enough. No room for errors. Got it. Now things are really going to ramp up because I have the, the, the key to get out. So now it's going to, like, skyrocket. Right? That's how D&D &D works. Nope. I want to see what was in no, but I don't think it's going to let me. 
There's no way in five minutes and ten seconds I got out. There's no way. Yeah, no, there's got to be a little bit more. This is a really short video, then. I mean, I do dig the short horror game aesthetic. I'm fine with it. I enjoy it. Actually, oh, here we go. Jump scare in three, two, one. Oh. Okay, it subverted my expectations. That's nice. It happened. We went on the other side of the gates, and it did not. And uh, such a shame inside. It's the only safe place, although I am starting to doubt that as well. All right, give me the key, give me the key, the key. Thank you. I didn't read what the key was for, which might have been a mistake. I see your eyeballs over there. I see you. Oh, 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 there's a couple. Am I locked in here now? Oh, there's a lot of eyeballs. Looking for the gate to get out there with the eyeballs. Oh. What are those things? Spooks. Homie. Stay on the path. Yes. Okie doke. Ah. Just gotta stay on the path. That's all. The blue light, false sense of security. It's actually the worst place to be. Wait a minute. This is the path. I'm not supposed to get off of it. That music is calming. Now for a jump scare. What was that thing? That was actually cool looking. That was cool. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. Be sure to check in for the next one, guys. Because I'm going to see you there.